coming to you from our GIS studios. I am Anicia Antoine and this is your midday news brief. The government of the Republic of China, Taiwan, continues to play a tremendous role in improving the education sector in St. Lucia. Most recently, the Ambassador of the Republic of China, Taiwan to St. Lucia, His Excellency Douglas Shen, presented 30 ASUS laptops to the Boys Training Center. His Excellency Douglas Shen noted that this initiative will allow the wards at the center an opportunity to develop their technological skills. Referring to the donation as timely and important, the general manager of the Boys Training Center, Wang Sonson, expressed gratitude to the government of the Republic of China, Taiwan, for their donation. The parliamentary representative for Grosley, Honorable Leonard Montout, noted that this initiative will ensure that the boys at the center are provided with the facilities to better equip themselves and enhance their experience. The handing over ceremony took place on Monday, November 18, 2019. The parliamentary representative for Ancillary Canaries, Honorable Dominic Fede, presented a check donation of 10,000 EC dollars to the fire victim of Otabo Ancillary. The two story building was completely destroyed on Thursday, November 7, leaving at least six persons homeless. Honorable Dominic Fede pledged to aid in any way possible. The women of Ancillary Canaries groups also presented donations, including house supplies and school items. Reeves Lawrence, Deputy Chair of the Ancillary Village Council, noted that other fundraising efforts will be made on behalf of Ms. Hippolyte. Prime Minister of St. Lucia, Hon. Alan Chastney, commended the parliamentary representative and constituents of Ancillary Canaries for moving quickly in bringing aid to the victims of the fire incident. Fire victim Ursula Hippolyte expressed gratitude to the government of St. Lucia for the donation. The handing over ceremony took place on Monday, November 18, 2019. The Governor-General of St. Lucia, His Excellency Sir Emmanuel Neville Snack, hosted the investiture of the recipients of Her Majesty the Queen's Birthday Honours for June 2019 into the Order of Chivalry of the Most Excellent Order of the British Empire. The Order of Chivalry was initially created to reward the efforts by the civilians and servicemen in support positions during World War I. Since its institution, Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II has made subsequent alterations to the Statute of Ordinances of the Order so that awards are now given to those who make distinguished and notable contributions to their country. Of the 11 recipients who were honoured under the Order of Chivalry of the Most Excellent Order of the British Empire, eight individuals received their honours in St. Lucia, whilst three opted to receive their investiture in the United Kingdom. Prime Minister of St. Lucia, Hon. Alan Chastney, congratulated the awardees on receiving such a prestigious award. The investiture ceremony took place on Friday, November 15, 2019. This has been your midday news brief. Thank you for watching.